Imagine you're outside on a sunny day, and suddenly, the entire sun's energy, all 400 trillion trillion watts of it, gets focused onto one single point on Earth. What happens next? Spoiler. We wouldn't even have time to say sunscreen. Okay, so normally the sun spreads its energy evenly across the whole Earth. That's why sunlight feels warm and not instantly lethal. But let's say, for some reason, a cosmic magnifying glass the size of the solar system bends every single photon hitting Earth and focuses it all in one spot. Let's find out what that looks like before that spot stops existing. First off, the sun outputs about 3.8 times 10 to the 26th watts. That's 380 billion 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 joules every second. If all that energy hit, say, a single square meter of ground, that spot would receive more power than every nuclear bomb ever detonated per second. In the first microsecond, the ground would vaporize. In the next microsecond, the surrounding air would turn into plasma hotter than the sun's core. A fireball forms, not just a mushroom cloud, but a planet-melting explosion. The ground under it would evaporate and the shockwave would tear through the atmosphere faster than sound could even travel. Basically, you'd have a glowing hole where that city, or country, used to be. But here's the twist. It wouldn't stop there. The heat would reflect, scatter, and radiate outward. Within seconds, the atmosphere itself would ignite in a worldwide inferno. Oceans, boiled, crust, molten, Earth now resembles a small, shiny marble of lava. In fact, so much energy would be released that the entire planet would vaporize completely into space dust. It'd be like the sun blinked and said, whoops, my bad. So yeah, focus Focusing all the sun's power in one place isn't just dangerous, it's game over for Earth. The good news? Physics won't let this happen. The sun's light spreads naturally, keeping us toasty instead of toast. If you liked this cosmic barbecue of a thought experiment, hit that like button, drop your wild what-if ideas in the comments, and subscribe for more science-powered madness.